having trouble getting your Vice camera to complete its updates? Stick around till the end and check out all the steps that I mentioned in this video as either one just might work for you in getting your Vice camera updated to its latest available version. Now, if automated OT updates are not working for you, you can try to manually invoke the update process. Most Wise cameras support an SD card and with this provision, you can manually flash a firmware on your camera without depending on the Wise app. To manually flash a firmware on your Wise camera, first get hold of an XFAT or a FAT32 formatted micro SD card. Next, head over to the Wise release notes and firmware page from a browser which I've added in the description below. Download the firmware corresponding to your Wise camera. Extract the files to your SD card and ensure to rename the file as shown on screen. Unplug the SD card and plug it into your Wise camera while it's powered off. Press and hold the setup button on the camera and plug in the power cable while the button is pressed. Keep the button pressed for about 3 to 5 seconds until the lights on your Wise camera turn purple. For Wise Cam V2 and first gen pan cameras, the LEDs should light blue. After about 3 to 5 minutes, the LED should change the color, indicating that the update is complete. You can also manually check the firmware version of your camera using the Wise app and trigger the automated update process by tapping on the thumbnail of your camera from the Wise app. Then tap on the settings gear on top and navigate to the device info tile. Tap on the firmware version tab to invoke the update. The easiest and the most effective fix for most issues on your Wise camera is to simply power cycle the device. Power cycling is a mode of rebooting your device, but on the hardware end. In doing so, you quash a lot of bugs and errors, which might be the reason behind your Wise cameras not updating to its latest version. To power cycle your Wise camera, simply unplug it from its power supply and plug it back in after a few seconds. For the battery powered versions, ensure that the batteries have sufficient charge to sustain the operations of your camera. If you're having trouble charging the battery properly, consider replacing the battery pack. With wired wise cameras, make sure that the condition of your cables and the power adapter is fine. Wear and tear and nasty bends can all impede the power supply. Switch any such damaged accessories with new ones, preferably from Wise or any reputed brand. The internet is very crucial for your Wise camera to undergo a firmware update. If you have issues with your network like slow speeds, a faint signal strength or high latency, Wise cameras may struggle to complete the update. You can check for issues with your internet by connecting to a different device like your phone to the same network as your Wise camera and by watching one of our many videos on Wise cameras. If you have trouble surfing the internet, consider power cycling your internet router. Simply unplug the router from its power source and plug it back in after a minute. Next, consider switching the network of your Wise camera. Although older Wise cameras only support the 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi band, the newer ones do come with dual band support. To change the network of your Wise camera, open the Wise app and select the plus sign. Select Add Device and tap on Cameras. Choose your Wise camera from the list of devices and follow through with the setup process until you reach the Network Selection tab. Choose a network of your liking and enter the login credentials to complete the setup. Also, be mindful of the distance between your camera and your internet router. If the signal strength is feeble, place the camera closer to your internet router without much obstacles in between. Opting for Wi-Fi extenders or mesh points is a great way to enhance the signal strength. Once you've ensured a proper power supply and a stable network connection, try updating your cameras once again. If the steps that I've mentioned so far are not working for you, you can try resetting your Wise cameras to its factory defaults. Factory resetting your Wise cameras will reset all its configurations and you'll have to set it up from scratch once again. To reset your Wise camera, locate and press the setup button on the bottom of your camera till you hear a beep sound followed by a ready to connect message. Now go to the Wise app on your phone and delete your Wise camera from your system. Then add the camera back again by following through with the scanning process to get your Wise camera back in action. Following all the steps that I've mentioned so far should help your Wise cameras get updated to its latest available version without much hassle. If you found this video useful, do comment your thoughts below 
give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more voice content like this.